Good morning. Good morning. How you doing? I'm doing well. The oh, energy is amazing. Man. Yes, man. I'm because you're, you're, you're in the building, man. He came, <laughs> my, he came in the studio with such an energy, man. By Ladies. the way, I'm, I'm, I'm a big fan of you. Oh, I used man. to listen to you. Back then, you were in uh, Afro, Afro FM. Yes, yes. It's such an inspiring show. Oh, man. Thank, thank you, you so much, man. <laughs> it's crazy, man. I, for those of you just joining us, Mani Azul is an amazing motivational speaker. He's a sensation on all the social media platform. He is motivating people around the world. People are here. <laughs> and we're going to talk about his experience. But first is first. Thank you so much for coming and joining us this Monday morning. It's, really it's my pleasure. I'm pumped to be here. Yes. Thanks for having me. Yes. So, I mean, let's just start off with basic thing. What got you in this motivational world? And what, you know, what inspires you? What, what inspired you to, in, to get into this world? Well, uh, I'm very happy. It was life, you know. My childhood was dreadful, mm -hmm. dark. Mm -hmm. You know, my families were super poor. Mm -hmm. So that I, I've been bullied to in high school, in university. Mm -hmm. You know, when life is challenging you, when life is really hard, you start asking a question, you know, why am I being on such kind of situation? What is life? How can I be happy? How can I overcome this challenge? And, and I started reading books, you know, thank God there was internet. Mm -hmm. And I started Googling on YouTube. And I'm a I'm spiritual guy mm -hmm. from very early on. I grew up in church. Mm -hmm. So I pray, I meditate, I ask God. And the challenge of life got me here. In the process of asking, reading, you know, discussing with people, praying, I found this thing. You know, people have to know themselves. People need to have a purpose. Mm -hmm. They have to overcome their conditioned mind. Mm -hmm. And I'm here. Damn, man. <laughs> yeah, man. So, I mean, those challenges made, made you the person you are right now. 100%. Well. And that's one of the main things we always say is well, when you go through something, love it because you, it's programming you to become something better. Yeah. And this, <laughs> this is the better version of you because of the challenge you went through. Yes, so. I love challenge. You know, yeah. I really do. Every mm -hmm. single day, I put myself in challenge mm -hmm. to test my true potential. Mm -hmm. How far can I go? How much people can reach? How how much how much money can I make? Mm -hmm. You know, every single day, mm -hmm. I go straight up to challenge, and most people are afraid to do that. Mm -hmm. But it's 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 a life. Yes, yeah, just definitely is, and I think that to have that kind of mentality is very very strong. You know, it's a strong mentality. And earlier on the show, we were talking about New Year. By the way, Happy New Year! Happy New Year <laughs> for everyone! And yes. <laughs> so, what's your thought? Do you believe in New Year resolutions? And what do you think people should say? I don't believe. Mm -hmm. I don't. I believe, and I don't believe. Yeah, I'm from Arbami Internet. Every New Year, I can go there and reflect. Mm -hmm. Back, I can mentally I come to Addis. Mm -hmm. How was my last year? Mm -hmm. I can see w what happened, what didn't happen. I literally reflect and I plan. It works for me, but it's not because the new year. I plan every moment, every minute, you know, every day, every week, every month. I have to plan. This is life. It's not a new year. Most people, when the new year comes, I'm gonna be this person. Mm -hmm. I wanna do this, that. I wanna become that. Well, after two weeks. They are the same old person. So, I don't believe in the New Year resolution. I believe in a life resolution. Mm -hmm. You need to have a crystal clear purpose. You need to have something drives you every single day. Mm -hmm. Whether it's New Year or not, you got to be on the do mode. Mm -hmm. So that people, yes, it's inspiring. The radio, the music, everything is awesome. Even the nature is awesome. But unless you are changing... Your mentality, your conditioning, mm. your thinking, New Year is nothing. Mm. New Year is nothing. Most people, they plan, they're not achieving that plan. Mm. Well, so what do you have to say for those people that are planning or not doing? What do you think they should do different 2014? <laughs> Look into the mirror and there is a person they are not seeing. They are not watching. Mm. That ego, that conditioned mind, you know, that negative self-image, negative thinking, that keeps them like negative habit mm -hmm. in the same comfort zone, the same trap. They're dragging them back. They're not aware of it. Most people think it's a government. It's my boss. It's my family. It's my teacher. Mm -hmm. It's my girlfriend. My wife. No, no, no. It's your thinking. Mm -hmm. It's your negative habit. People, if you are not changing your habit, you're not going to change your results. So you need to focus on how can I change my habit? 
when you are asking this question, it's really hard. Mm. You need to challenge yourself. You need to pay the price. You need to do, you know, th that push your limit. Mm. And most people, we, we love the comfort zone. Mm. We love being the old version of ourselves mm. because it is comfortable. Mm -hmm. So that to me is, if they change their habit, habit, when I say habit, their reading habit, eating habit, mm -hmm. praying habit, you know, content consumption habit, co consumption habit, mm -hmm. if they change their habit, if they Google, how can I change my habit? Mm -hmm. There are books on that. It's well researched area. If they ask themselves, how can I change my finance habit, my communication habit, my spiritual habit, my exercise habit, there are different ways by changing their habit, they can change their life too. Mm. And I think that people don't want to get uncomfortable. Though. They, they already know that. Though. Yeah. That people are going to go online. They're going to see some hacks on how to make their life better. Or uh -huh. how to do, uh -huh. They won't do it because it means that things are being uncomfortable. And how do people... It's crazy. What, I think discipline, we're talking about discipline. Yeah. What does discipline mean to you, though? When it comes discipline to is doing, uh, doing the right thing. I mean, you know, do it, doing what you hate as if you love it. Mm. I oh, hate preach. waking up early. I hate reading books. I hate creating videos and posting on social media. There are a lot of negative comments. Mm. I hate my life. You know? But I do it mm -hmm. because it gives me the result I want. Mm -hmm. My confidence, my energy, mm -hmm. my growth, my social media uh, exposure, personal, but everything comes from the things I had to do, but I still do it, no matter what. Mm. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> it takes a God, a mental toughness mm. to become the person you want to become. Mm. It's really, really hard. Go and ask Kaila Gabriel Sablasi. Mm. Discipline is, you know, a life and death issue to me. He personally told me, discipline is a death and life issue to me. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Everybody, you know, who is successful, He's successful because of his discipline. It's not because he's talent. Lot of, there are a lot of people who are talented in music, mm -hmm. you know, talented in like, in business, in talking to people, even motivating. Mm -hmm. But the fine line is discipline, doing the thing that you had to do. Yeah. That's a very powerful concept. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, you're getting a powerful message this year. 2014 is going to be your year. Once again, Happy New Year. Monday as well as in the building. Let's get to a New Year's song and then we're going to be back. And when we come back, we're going to talk about so many interesting things. And we do have a topic. Are we poor or are we lazy today? We're going to talk about it with the man today. Let's get to an amazing, an amazing tune by Endenya Hobelen. Let's get to that and we'll be right back. Yeah. <laughs> Man. It's amazing, right? Man. Your voice. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I was about to stand up. It's a man? All right. Okay. Thank you. 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 Thank you.